Do you ever wonder that what if a mutual fund shuts down or if its business gets acquired or if it's merged with another entity? Well, such questions can be a matter of serious concern for existing as well as potential investors. However, here are a few points that one needs to know. Mutual funds are regulated by the Securities and Exchange Board of India, that is SEBI. If your mutual fund house is planning of shutting down its business, then the trustees to the fund house will need to take permission from SEBI. At instances, even SEBI themselves can ask the fund house to close down. Now, the important thing to note here is, for such events, there is a prescribed process that needs to be followed and adhered to. If you have invested in any scheme of any such fund house, all investors are returned their fund based on the last available net asset value. Before winding up, there could be a scenario where a fund house is acquired by a different fund house. In that case, the scheme in their original form can be managed by the new fund house managing it. Or the schemes could be merged with the schemes in the new fund house. SEBI's approval is required for all mergers and acquisitions, as well as for scheme level mergers too. In all such cases, the investors are given an option to exit from the schemes without any exit load being charged. All such actions by the investor or fund house shall be always be done at prevailing net asset value. Hope now you know all about acquisition, merger and shutting down of a mutual fund. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risk. Read all scheme related documents carefully.